I thought so too. Does it feel good to be back at it, serving your country? I wouldn't go that far. Whoa! Whoa! Hold up! Do you see that wagon? Where they got it in for me. You could try washing once in a while. Oh. Come on, mister. Keep your eyes open. No. Oh. This must have happened recently. Hmm. Hey, come have a look at this. Look. Suit and tie. One bullet clean through the forehead. Well, my money says this is the handiwork of a gang called the Lemoyne Raiders. Yeah, I've run into them. Let's see if we've got any identification. Okay. We should get going. I'll send someone over here later to clean this up. Dangerous business, the life of a lawman, isn't it? Appears so. I'm just glad we got Archibald here to show us the ropes. <laughs> Would you mind taking the reins? I want to have a look at these papers. Sure. I'll direct you. Okay. Frederick Mitchell. Lemoyne State Legislator. Poor fella. Yes, this certainly smacks of the Raiders to me. Bunch of ex-army free staters without an ounce of respect for the law. Go right at the crossroads. Yep. Not the nicest fellas in my experience. Easy. We ain't in that much of a hurry. They're right again here. Oh, and I know the Braithwaites are in business with them. No shame. Trash begets trash, my Uncle Reginald used to say. He had a few stories, let me tell you. Town preacher and town sheriff. They drink a sailor under the table before breakfast. He had one tiny hand, like a child's, on the end of a grown man's arm. Here we are. So what was I saying? Something about the Braithwaite's, I think. Even saying that word makes me sick. Now, anyone we find here, we bring in alive, understood? Round them up, and take this operation down for good. Come on. Tell you boys, what did I say? I said this place was crawling with vermin, and we just found ourselves the rat's nest par excellence, as they say in Paris. My aunt, she went to Paris back in '78. How handle this? Well, the way I see actually, let my friend here decide. He doesn't have your fine way with words, but he is definitely the man for the job. Let's split up, Arthur and Bill, me and Archibald. You boys want right or left? We'll take the ride. Let's stop these filthy, degenerate tax dodgers. The cheek of them, a fine idea. Remember what he said. We need them alive. Let's just knock them out, and then tie them up. Got it, Deputy Williamson. We won't catch the rider. Grab the other fella.
one's coming. Stay out of sight. Anthony! Anthony, where you at, boy? Let's gather them up. That's it. Well, what do we do now? We better destroy all this. Any of your boys can handle explosives. Sure. Anyone but him. Oh, so. I think you're real funny, don't you? Tell me about that. <laughs> that is the last time I'll mention it, I swear.
I don't see any more. Do you? No. Let's find Dutch and get out of here. Fine by me. <laughs> well, forgive me, but me and my men must return to our lives. Ah, seems like we failed to destroy the last of the moonshine. Sure. Would you like us to? Well, I normally take it. For personal consumption, it's sort of part of the job. But I better get back home. Why don't I just take a jug or two and leave you boys the rest to show that there's no hard feelings on account of the war? We are all Americans. Of course. My cousin, Webster, he used to say some of us is not as American as others, if you know what I mean. Only I didn't, quite. Come on, you degenerate, no good, white trash, hillbilly piece of scum. I know you, Billy Lime. Finally. You've always been a Finally. piece of crap. Come on, move it. We have a life it. It. on a land so stupid, a backwater so backwards that even we are like geniuses. <laughs> Bill, get this stuff out of here. Come on, you ride with me. Okay. Should I stash this somewhere near camp, boss? Yes, show it to Hosea. I'm sure he can find a use for it. Come on, Arthur, let's get back to camp. Mount up, let's go. Can we leave this swamp now, please? Bit of trouble back there, Arthur? Ain't there always. From what they was yelling, I think they were the buyers. Old Archibald didn't ask too many questions, so neither should we. I ain't planning to. 
That was worth the effort, though. Deputized and hiding in plain sight. These lawmen. These two families. I mean, I really think we can play this from all sides. It's got Hosea written all over it. This is starting to sound like the Young Dutch again. What do you mean? What are you shooting for? What do you mean, Young Dutch? I'm as strong as I have ever been. Hey, you know what? Why don't I race you back? Yeah. If you say I'm old, prove it. <laughs> okay, you're on. That's the spirit. Okay, on my word. Set, go. Quite so good at running away, Arthur. Oh, I never knew age had slowed you down quite so much. <laughs> well, time is a bastard. When you get to be my age, well, you'll know that better than anything. Be well. I had fun with you today. You're, I was gonna say you're like a son to me, but you're more than that. You know, I think I've heard enough of your opinions, miss. <laughs> <laughs> 